This is the time of year where you can find sprawling yard sales on any given weekend, but a special one this morning helped a local young boy in his fight against leukemia. 10 News reporter Taj Simmons tells us how many people stepped up to both donate and find deals for the cause. As the saying goes, one person's trash is another's treasure. But this collection of secondhand stuff could be a lifeline for 10 year old Cameron Clausen and his family. It touches your heart. It's uh, emotional. Yeah, it's, it's, it's just absolutely amazing to see. Cameron was diagnosed with leukemia in April, and every dollar from the yard sale will go to his mounting medical bills. It raised more than $6,000 for Team Cam, and the massive show of support left Cam himself in disbelief. I don't really know, like, like I know they're there, but sometimes I don't feel it. The mountains of memorabilia built up in only two weeks of donating. Tracy Watkins, who came up with the idea for the yard sale, says the only challenge was getting all the stuff out to sell. A 20-foot U-Haul, one, two, three, five vehicles full of stuff, and taking the U-Haul back again to refill to bring out here because the community brought so many things. Those mountains slowly shrunk as shoppers hauled away what they wanted, but Cam still has a hard mountain to climb. He goes back to the hospital Monday for chemotherapy again, so it just worked out perfectly. Um, and he can actually see firsthand how many people love and are praying for him. And Cam treasures all of the people who showed up to buy whatever stuff they could find. Like, it makes me feel it more like, <laughs> than I would, like, believe it. In Salem, Taj Simmons, 10 News, working for you.